touchdown there and what that meant to you. Yeah, I mean, it meant a lot. You know, having some online go down after last game, Piper, uh, Turner, Nuri, those guys, like, they, they, fought, they fought every day for this program. And uh, just to have other guys step up and come in was big. And I just give credit to them. It was a great run. And just trusting my training, what Coach EJ teach me in practice. And, you know, it just happened. Did God you see well. that lane right, th- right away, or did you? Uh, I'll definitely say I seen it. I seen it right away, but I had to be a little patient. Uh, that's how just how the plays drew up and stuff like that. But nah, it was just when I see green grass, I just you know I think hit it. So that's all I was thinking at the time. But, how was it running behind the new offensive line group this week? Uh, it was great. I run behind those guys in practice, and the good thing about it is I feel like I've got reps with you know the one O line, two O line, everybody. So I feel like it wasn't much different from practice. It felt just like we was out there practicing uh, like a normal practice day. A, a lot of snaps these last couple of weeks. Where would you say your confidence is from the beginning of the season until now? I would say my confidence hasn't changed at all. I think I've always been confident in myself. And, you know, I've just been trusting God, having faith in him. And I feel like everything that I'm doing right now is for a reason. I think everything, everything happens for a reason. And I was put in that situation for a reason. So, you know, I'm just going to go out there and just keep doing me and trying to help the team win, most importantly. How, how tough were the yards to kind of come by? Now, yeah, this is one of those games where, you know, you got to get the two-yard runs, three-yard runs, and then eventually it's going to pop open. So just trust in your O-line, you know, even when you're not getting the biggest runs and everything because you're going to have to make big plays and big moments like that. And I feel like just trusting those guys up front meant everything. Yeah. In the fourth quarter when the momentum was kind of shifting a little bit, I mean, what, what was kind of the attitude of the offense running back out there on the drive that, that you ended up scoring on? Yeah, it was definitely, you know, a lot of adversity with the turnovers and everything. Uh, leading up to it, but like I said, I think our team's been through so much as an offense that you know that moment wasn't too big for nobody. Even though we had turnovers and everything, everybody was positive on the sideline and everybody was ready to bounce back uh, and just go score. I told the old line before that play, I said, just protect up front for a second, and I'll be gone. So, I believe this is the third straight week you guys have won despite losing the turnover battle. Does it seem like there's consistent themes week to week, or just bad breaks? Like, what, what do you chalk that up to? Uh, as far as turnovers, you're saying? Yeah. Uh, I'll definitely just say, uh, you know, there's a couple turnovers that we can control. It's it's, th- it's everything that we can control. It's not really uh, something that, you know, we're not being tired or anything. It's just up to us to, you know, protect the football, put the defense in a good situation. And so moving forward, we're going to continue to work on that in practice. And I just believe in what Coach Rule teaches us. So we just got to do a better job protecting the ball on offense. <coughs> Do you have any family in the stands today, friends? We're here to see that touchdown. Yeah, my family was there. Mom, dad, I love all of them. They come to every home game. You know, even when I wasn't playing, they were coming. So I love them a lot. Do you have a chance to talk to them or read any texts yet? Uh, I mean, I haven't read like a whole bunch. There's a whole bunch of texts, but uh, I said I love you to my mom. I just seen her before I came out here. So. Thanks, Evan. Appreciate.